we're going to be changing the jack shaft bearings. Uh, we've got a T5, a hex, and got our jack shaft. We're going to be changing these bearings out. Um, the long side bushing. is on the gear side the cog side is the smaller so we're just gonna get after it here removing this Long bolts will be on the gear side, short on the cog. Okay, now we need to go get these bearings out. Um, I'm using a hex T40 to come down in here. You got to push kind of to the side to get that middle bushing. Um, moved over so you can get the lip of that that bearing and that's the dust cover and I'm gonna go put this on my vise just right here where we can beat that out I've got two hammers I might have to use them both okay I'm gonna take these go the dust covers out just like that the flat head I've noticed these bearings or if you just touch the jack shaft after running your bike uh, if it's warm or hot that just means I feel like that the uh, the belt's too tight or the chain might be too tight and that really impacts these bearings I'm gonna use this metal hammer once again we're using a t40 hex pushing that middle bushing to the side and just finding that place on that bearing moving Six o'clock, we'll go twelve o'clock. Side to There's one, there's two. I've been to this before, but there must be some Loctite on this gear. Uh, so I'm gonna warm it up, see if I can get that off. Um, also, you'll notice these washers, one's small, one's big. This will go on the gear side, this will go on the cog side. I'm going to warm this up, see if I can give it some taps here. All the jack shafts I've worked on, this just comes right off. Some Loctite must have gotten under this though. Hey, there we go. We've got the jack shaft, all the bearings out. Um, we are going to start putting in the bearings. Um, here's one that's already 
made up. Um, there's just a little, see that? A little recess there. I'm gonna use just a little grease. Okay, I'm gonna be using a 11 sixteenths. I'm gonna tap this down. see from this factory how far that's going to go down. Eleven sixteenths. I need to go a little more. Okay. Now the other side. Okay, let's make sure and get our bushing in. Turn the writing, I'm not sure if it matters. Turn the writing face up. Okay, we want this sprocket side to have just a small recess. But we're gonna get this where that bushing's not rattling around. Okay, it's not rattling around anymore. Dust cover. Let's 
going to be the larger one, this side, and it's the smaller screws on this side, on the cog side. cover on this end we're small pushing cog side longer bushing sprocket side that's it that's upgraded bearings <laughs>